We begin with some breaking news tonight. A toddler has drowned in a pool during a family get together in Pompano Beach. The three year old was rushed to the hospital, but he did not survive. CBS 4's Nagy Newland is on the scene in Pompano Beach. Don't take your eyes away from your children, not even for one minute. A heartbreaking message from the family of a little boy who died in a backyard swimming pool. His great uncle says this was three year old Enrique Amorim. He's a very bright little kid, you know, the future soccer player of the family. That's what everybody loved him. He always carried that little ball with him. Investigators say family members had gathered at this Pompano home, enjoying the sunshine on a Sunday afternoon. At some point after the family went inside, apparently Enrique slipped out of the house. When the gathering ended, one of Enrique's uncles made the horrifying discovery. When the uncle was leaving the property and was doing some cleaning up in the backyard that he actually spotted the child at the bottom of the pool. He jumped in, pulled him out, began to do CPR. Immediately, all the family members began to call for help. My nephew, you know, his uncle called us and uh, told us that, you know, something bad had happened, an accident had happened and uh, ask us to pray for maybe a miracle could happen. But by the time Enrique got to the hospital, he couldn't be saved. Now his family is left to grieve and remember the little boy whom everyone loved so much. I think uh, the time that he spent here is a little angel that God really, you know, gave us to make our lives even happier during the time that he was here. So we're going to miss him a lot. His great uncle says the little boy was afraid of water. According to BSO, there was no fence around the pool. In Pompano, Maggie Newland, CBS 4 News Tonight.